Now I just... Oh. I said I don't even need to change the... Thank God the game is loud though, hold up. Why is the game so goddamn loud? But yeah, we're... I think, uh, I think Sharon had a bit, had a, had a bit of a, has a bit of a thing for Yandere's. <laughs> Judging by the games that I've been playing so far. It's been, this game is literally called Yanderella. Like, they, I can't, like, you can't get more on the nose of that, than that. <laughs> Oh. Once upon a time, there was a beautiful kind girl named Cinderella. Oh. Now I get the name. Okay. That is oddly genius, but also not quite. <laughs> And though she was more beautiful, more kind, more precious, more cheerful than anyone else, it never did her any good. Her sisters worked her to the bone every day. Ow, I hit my table. Or desk. She was unable to go to the ball, unable to meet her prince. All she could do was clean. God damn it, the game is so loud. Hold on. A princess covered in cinders. Yataro. I was finally able to see you. I've been wanting to see you this whole time. <laughs> it's been a while, huh? I am your bride. I am the princess fated to be your bride. I hope you cast a spell on me. Cast? Don't cast? Uh... Does this matter to- Uh, you know what? Do you kill me if I don't cast it? Oh, the music is stopping. Oh, I think. Oh, never mind. I think that impacted something. I have no idea what, but it impacted something. Come on! Yataro! Get up, sleepyhead! Ah! Jeez, we're finally up. Good morning. You're making a racket there. Are you having a scary dream? Well, I'm sure you were just having some kind of dirty dream. I know you. She knows, she knows me too well. Why are you in my room, intruder? Why are you in my room? Huh? Wait, 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 wait. Don't tell me you forgot already. 
I emailed you about it the other day. Hinata is arriving today, so we're going to go to the station to meet her. Uh, Hinata? No way. Are you saying you forgot about her too? I'm shocked, you are horrible. Hinata, the one who moved to Tokyo when we were little. The three of us would play together all the time. Don't tell me, you really don't remember her? Uh, meep. What is meep? Or is it like... Or is it like a tongue out noise? Like a meh. Like that. <laughs> there was no way you could have forgotten. We were all so close back then. Jeez, get a grip, will you? Come on, it's almost time for us to meet her. Hurry up and get ready. The station is just east after leaving your house. I bet that dream we had, that was like the final choice in the game. It will decide the whole, it will decide the endings, I bet. Ooh, ooh, what's up? Hi. Uh, is this the first time Usa actually has like a dedicated portrait? I offer you a save point. Uh, as I offer you my save point services throughout the nation. Care to save? Yes. Inside the trash can lies nothing like my soul. A bunch of my favorite manga are lined up on the bookshelf. There are some dirty magazines too. Inside the drawer are a bunch of games in a messy heap. I can't decide whether to sell or keep them. My school uniform is hanging here. I don't need to go to school. It's a pain in the ass. I feel you. My fluffy bed. Inside the drawer are passbooks, seals, and other important things. Mom's favorite dinner plates are lined up in the cupboard. Mom's shopping list is attached to the fridge. Toothpaste, shampoo, fabric soft... Fabric soft and... Soft... In there and sake. What a homely list. Some tea is still in the teapot. Weakened from being exposed to air. A phone we got for uh, 1980 yen. It's tiny. There's still some tea left in, in the cup. There's a fly floating in the tea as well. Well, it's new, free nutrients. Inside the trash can lies nothing. Playing games on a computer is more fun than playing them on a TV. Wait, no. Go back in. I want to explore the house a little more. One of mom's precious stuffed animals. And the only one. That I can see. Mom's chest of drawers is like a black hole. I probably shouldn't open it. I bet there's like an ending where like you just die if you open it. And you just get sucked in into an endless void in space. Mom's closet is like a black hole. I probably shouldn't open it. Jesus Christ. A brand name code is hanging on the rack. So Inside the trash can lies Magical Girl Misato Tan's super secret notebook. Read it. Magical Girl Misato Tan will use her Meowjik to save the world. This is my super important mutation. I'm not messing around. What? What? Don't look at me that way. Perhaps you're not convinced.
geez, all right. I'll let the cat out of the bag. I'll show you my true form just this once. Look, I'm just a perfiline normal high school girl. Okay, that didn't even make sense. Come on, perfiline? Like, that, that, that doesn't even share, like, most of the... Like, that, that, that doesn't even rhyme with perfect. Perfectly. Chock full of moe moe charm. It's not like I've come, I've become used to being a magical girl or anything, okay? The notebook ends here. I'm sure mom would like to forget about that part of her past. Oh god. She wrote that. Poor mom. A fluffy bed. It smells like mom. I don't think you should smell your mom's bed, but okay. You do you, my guy. Can't break into people's houses. It's Honoka's house. Oh, my head. Ow. Coffee. Ah. ah. There's a fountain here. The water is somewhat, somewhat cloudy. There's a bench here. It's full of bird droppings. I don't think anyone will be sitting on it anytime soon. There's a bench here. Okay. Rebirth Park. It's a plan that hasn't been taken care of. The table and chairs have been polished to shine. I wonder how much they paid these people who cleaned them. The plant that has been tended to quite well. Business Hotel Takashiki. It's home. It seems to be a hotel owned by someone named Takashiki. I don't need to go into any in hotel. It's a train, train station sign. It was a rusty old uh, dump back then, but they rebuilt it and completely renovated the inside. The sound is slowly changing bit by bit. Wait, oh wait, this is the way to go? Shit. This is gonna be fun. How many years has it been? Ugh, oh, jeez, what a great time to have you go to the restroom. To have to go to the restroom. Hold on, okay? I'll be right back. Ah. Yataro? Is that you, Yataro? It is, it's Yataro. It's me, Hinata. Do you remember me? I transferred away during elementary school. I used to play with you and Honoka all the time. <laughs> Did I surprise you? I returned, finally, back to this town. It sure is nostalgic. Yataro. I was finally able to see you. I've been wanting to see you this whole time. <laughs> it's been a while, huh? I am your bride. I am the princess fated to be your bride. I hope you cast a spell on me. Okay. Fuck it, let's cast. Damn, we're just 
jumping straight into there. Huh? Hey, Yataro. Do you want to know why I came back here? I'll tell you just this once. Just keep it a secret, okay? I came to meet my prince. Hey! Just what do you think you're doing, jerk? Get away from Hinata, you perv. Blonk. Hanukkah's fist hit my hits my cheek. Which cheek? Now that's the real question here. Hey now. Yataro, are you okay? Honoka, violence is a no no. Yataro, you dumbass. Don't get cocky just because you haven't seen Hinata in a while. Uh no, it's not my... Huh? Are you gonna blame it on Hinata now? You're terrible. It's been a while since... It's been a while, Hinata. I've been wanting to see you again. Yes, it has. I've been wanting to see you too. Both you and Yataro. I'm glad you two look so energetic. You're looking pretty cheery yourself. That's a relief. Once you found... Once you found out you were moving, you wouldn't stop crying. And now I have... And now I bet you have plenty of fun in Tokyo, even without us around. Well, I can't say that I don't, but I really do like it better here. This town is much better than Tokyo. Huh? <laughs> the three of us standing here and talking again is like a dream come true. But it's not a dream, right, Yataro? I think. Let's pinch a cheek to find out. Hmm? I guess that would be the easiest way to find out. Of course, it's gonna be your cheek, Yataro. Ah. Hey, Honoka, Yataro. Um, I kind of want, I kind of want to hang out together somewhere outside, just like the old days. Okay, let's go somewhere. Where should we go? Secret base? Wow, I, I sure have a variety of choices here. Secret base? It's still around? Oh. Yataro, you haven't seen it. There's nothing there anymore. Eh? None of it is left at this point, as you'd expect. It, is that so? It was quite a while ago. It got torn down. I... I still want to go see. After all, we all made so many memories there. Even if there's no trace of it left, that's okay. Well... I guess that's where we're headed then, if Hinata wants to go. We'll go. Ugh. Thank you. Secret base is straight west after leaving the station. There's a vending machine here. Has all sorts of drink with, drinks with weird names. Loving Lunacy, Strawberry Milk. Love, yeah, Loving Lunacy, Strawberry Milk. Rotten Bastard Honey Milk. And Pure Evil Cafe Late. That, <laughs> the, the references to the... Um, 
what's it called? To Mixor. Oh. There's also a old time Kakaole. Again, I referenced the Mixor. There's a there's a vending machine here. It has all sorts of drinks with weird names. Oh, it's the same one. Okay, I guess there's nothing there. There it is. Couldn't go there before. Oh. Our secret base. <sighs> Sorry, but there's no way around it. The landlord got so angry. Oh wait, the landlord got angry and had it demolished. What's this gravestone? I made it for the base, you know? Honoka. I guess I didn't want to forget about it. I actually haven't been here in a while though. Huh? I definitely didn't put these flowers here. I wonder who did. Don't tell me. You? Yataro? <laughs> well, how about that? You still remember that after all. I thought you had stopped thinking about it altogether. Didn't I literally just suggest it like a minute ago? After all, once Hinata moved, you stopped coming over to play. You stopped talking to me too, and you went and dyed your hair blonde. You even started rebelling against your mom. You just went full on bad boy, huh? Is that so? Yataro, I'm sorry, it's all my fault. Well, that's... <laughs> You're jumping a little bit there, my guy. Not at all. <laughs> Thank you, Yataro. This place sure brings back a lot of memories. This part gives you uh, a view of the best scenery in the whole town. We should have played it a lot together. Yep. We took all sorts of stuff from our homes to make it to make the base. Of course, that also got us yelled at a lot. That summer break was kinda special, to me anyway. It was fun. It's not just you. Oh wait, it's not just you, I feel the same way. I'm sure Yataro does too. Right, Yataro? We'll never know what he said. Oh, flashback. The sun was beating down on us. After school, the three of us would walk home together. We would always wander around a bit before going home. The strong-willed Honoka and the meek Hinata. Together we built our secret base and had fun. Every day we would play until the sun went down. Went down. When I went back home, mom would have, mom would have dinner ready and waiting for me. That's how the days went by. 
are unforgettable summer days. But Hinata changed schools, and our happy days came to an end. Even when I played with Honoka, I felt like something was missing. Eventually, I stopped walking home with Honoka. I didn't play with her very much. I spoke with her less and less as well. Oh shit. I hold myself up in my room. Honoka and I became more and more distant. I keep hitting my desk. I'm moving way too much because I can't find a comfortable position. You have no idea how uncomfortable I am right now. I had realized only too late that the only thing that had kept us together was Hinata. Hinata had left for Tokyo. I like how in the flashback he was the shortest of the three and now he's the tallest. Like damn, my dude had a glow up. <laughs> but now... Being shoulder to shoulder with the two of them again gives me a strange feeling. We've all gotten a bit older but... It's almost as if we were able to return to those summer days. That's what it feels like. That was fun. I'm so happy that the three of us can be together like this again. <laughs> Don't get too worked up now. But yeah, it sure was fun back then. Uh, not to say I'm not having fun now. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. Neither you nor Yataro. By the way, Hinata. Do you have a place to stay tonight? If you don't, if you're okay with my house... No, that's okay. I'm staying in the hotel. Oh, okay. That's good. That's a load off- that's a load off my mind, too. Let's get together again tomorrow. Okay. It is summer vacation, after all. Not like I have, any, not like I have anything else to do. Yay, see you tomorrow. See ya. Oh. Usa, I need you. I have care to save? Yes. There are emails from Honoka and Hinata. Honoka. I'll be waiting on the pier. You better come. Hinata. I'll wait for you at the secret base. I want to talk, just the two of us. The pier is to the east. Secret base is to the west. Where should I go? Secret base. I think Hinata is best girl. Oh, it moves by itself now. Ah! Yataro, you came. I was waiting for you. I really believed you would come. <laughs> I've been wanting to talk to you alone. After all, it's been so long since I saw you. You really surprised me. I never expected your hair to be that color. I thought you might have gone and become a delinquent while I was away. 
But I'm glad that's not what happened. You're just the same as you were back then. Thank you, Yataro. Thanks for staying yourself. I think that might be one of the reasons I like you. Again, that's uh, a little forward, my guy. Like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, slow down, my guy. <laughs> huh? Oh, um, never mind. Forget I said anything. I really am happy, though. To think that I was the reason you went all gloomy. I was feeling the same way, you know? I was lonely. <laughs> you probably think it's weird how frank I am, huh? It's okay, I haven't told you a single lie. So, Yataro, do you remember your promise? The promise we made the day before I moved? Of course you do. I can tell even if you don't say anything. Fua. <laughs> I guess I'm kind of tired. I think I'll go back to the hotel and go to sleep. Thanks for the- thanks for today. I'm glad I was able to talk to you. See you tomorrow. It's night. Today was really fun. What kind of day will tomorrow be? I quietly closed my eyes with that thought in my mind. Second day. It's morning. A new email has arrived. It's from Honoka. We're waiting at the park. Let's go somewhere together with Hinata. Looks like it came 30 minutes ago. I should probably hurry up and get to the park. Usa, ah, hi. Here to save? Absolutely. Oh, Yataro, good morning. Hey, you finally showed up. I thought you might have backed out on us. I kind of slept. I went back to sleep twice. I see. Could you at least wake up in the morning from, from now on? It's already afternoon. Afternoon is morning to me. <laughs> Yataro, you sleepyhead. Oh yeah, Hinata and I were just talking. We were wondering about where to go. <sighs> where are we going? Oh. <laughs> the station. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff uh, to see at the station. Most of it uh, was just finished recently, so it's stuff that he not hasn't seen yet. Yeah, sounds fun. Alright then, let's get going. I'm already hungry. We can have... Uh... We can... Have... We... We can have go lunch... We can go have lunch together, is what 
the game probably means. So in here, I need to go to, no, the other way. No, that's the station. Where was it? I already forgot where I'm supposed to go. Wait, don't tell me that there is something behind here. No, there isn't. No? Wait, where am I going? <laughs> was it Honoka's house? Uh, so here. So I guess it was here. Okay, we're here. Good, I'm so hungry. Yeah, because Yataro took his sweet time waking up. Yataro, treat us to some burgers. My pleasure, you're gonna make me cry. My pleasure. Alright, that... Really? Is that okay with you? Thanks, Yataro. That was really good. Thanks for treating us, Yataro. Yo, Nard, how you doing? Yeah, thanks. That was yummy. <laughs> it's on me the next time we go out. I should probably make another coffee. Hinata, you're such a good person. <laughs> I'm never gonna cheat Yataro to anything, so I hope you make up for me. Oh, Honoka, don't be so hard on him. What a bitch. <laughs> I'm good, how are you doing? I'm tired. I wanna sleep, but I'm never gonna sleep ever again. Not on this stream, I won't. Unless I'm depressed as fuck and need to sleep. Or if I have a collab the, the next day, which that one, yeah, no, that that one. Honestly, I I I do a lot of things for for that second option, but this manga will make you cry your eyes out. Oh yeah, I never knew you read this. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I never knew you read this kind of stuff. Well, it's your choice. Yeah. Should go. I literally stocked up on coffee just because I knew, like. Like, right now, like, most of the streams, I'm pretty sure are, like, what, like, 50%, like, nothingness? Like, I act maybe more. Like, I haven't actually, like. Because in, in some way, I just, I just sleep and. They're like, and they're just, and like, it's just a whole, it's just a, a blank screen with me in it. But it worked. Yeah, I guess it did work. Honestly, I'm surprised the coffee actually worked because, because, uh, oh, wait, you mean the streams? Oh, um, did it work though? Because like. Cause like I'm pretty sure like most of most of the time, right? Someone would like drop in and like they would see oh nothing's going on and then they'd be like oh yeah you know okay cool I guess bye. <laughs> no, I don't I don't know if it worked that well. I'm not really. I'm not really into emotional stuff like that, though. I rarely ever cry. Same. Oh, I see. 
too bad. It's such a good story, too. Why not show it to Yataro? He's a crybaby. Slowly you're getting there? Yeah. Finally past 400. Hmm. You're right. Yatar is a gentle guy. I just realized, what does she have like bandages on her hair? Like that's not like a hair tie or something. That those are shit up like bandages, like the, like the ones you would wear like if you have like an injury. Like she did first aid on her hair. <laughs> Yataro, what do you think of this manga? I recommend it. It's about a boy who loves two different girls. You know, it sounds to me like it, like it's this, like like it's this game. But okay. Hmm. What? What is? What smells? Don't tell me. You... What? Yeah? Oh, you ass. Don't just stand there. Hurry up and go to the restroom. Did I just shit myself? Is that what happened? Ah. I hurried off to the restroom. Ah, uh, I managed to make it in time. I want to keep them waiting. I need to hurry back. <laughs> huh? What's up, Hinata? Oh, nothing. I just thought it was funny. You and Yataro. You two act like family. No, more like husband and wife. Who would ever marry that guy? Please don't get the wrong idea of us. So, do you like him? What? Why are you asking that out of the blue? Well, she is blue, so... That was a dumbass fucking joke. Why did I say that? Wait a minute. I just realized something. Choose your starter. Who do you pick? <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is literally like the perfect like I, I could not have been a better color for this game now that I think about it like damn that is good If I was more pixelated, I would fit right at home in this game. <laughs> Damn. Anyway. <laughs> I was just curious. So do you? N no, it's not like I like him or anything, Baka. We just get along well. Oh, I see how it is. I've loved Yatro since the old days. So could I confess to him? C confess? Is that a no? Oh, um, no, I mean... It's, uh... Right? Yeah, it's fine. 
fine. Really? I'm so glad. I thought you might like Yataro too, so I was really worried. Oh, well, that's great. After all, if you liked him as well, that would make us rivals. <laughs> I wanted to stay as your friend forever. Will you root for me? Uh. Oh. Uh, of course. I'll wish you luck after. I'll wish you luck. After all, we're friends, right? <laughs> Thanks. You promise to support me? Oh, look. Yatoro's on his way back. Let's go. Yeah, okay. Kind of a missed opportunity. He should he, he should have had green hair. I'm not just saying that. I mean, come on now. I mean, come on now. It would be perfect, you know. It's like triad colors, you know. Just look at the time. I have to get back. <laughs> it was so much fun. I don't want to go home. Come on, we can't have a cute girl like you walking around late at night. We'll send you off, so get on back. Let's hang out again tomorrow. Okay. You're okay with it too, right Yataro? Okay, you're gonna bleed me dry. What the fuck does that mean? Ah ha 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 ha. Don't let it get to your head now. Sure would be nice if this could last forever. Yeah. I wish the three of us could have always been. The three of us could always be like this. I'll see you two tomorrow. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Yataro, can I ask you something? It's, um, about Hinata. What do you think of her? What do you mean? What's with you all of a sudden? Uh. Uh, see, I... I was just wondering if you, um, like her, Hinata. It's not like there's some kind of special reason I'm asking. Baka. I was just a little curious. I, um... I'm gonna get going now. See you tomorrow. What's up? I'd rather be with Usa for the rest of the game. There are emails from Honoka and Hinata. I'm gonna wait for you at the pier. I'll whack you if you don't come from Honoka. Come to the secret base. I'll be waiting for you. The pier is today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, we're going with. I feel like bad things will happen if I don't go here. But to be fair, bad things will probably happen regardless. So, Hinata? Good evening, Yataro. I'm glad you came. 
The night sky is as pretty as always here. But... The town itself has changed quite a bit since I left, hasn't it? The station wasn't nearly as big back then. And it barely had any people either. It's so huge now, it's like a department store. It's not bad that business is booming now, but... The town's natural beauty is slowly being covered with concrete. Kinda feels like I've been left behind, just a little. <laughs> it's not like I'm sad though. I was just thinking. It's almost like all the things I did together with you and Honokar are fitting away. I won't forget them, da da da. Uh, I won't forget them. Sure. Yataro. Are you worried about me? Thank you. I'm okay though. Just like this town, people too can eventually change. I'm well aware. Even off the fact that eventually one will begin to hate something they love. Ah, I think I might have st stayed here talking to you for too long. Good night, Yataro. See you tomorrow. It's night. Oh, my throat. Ugh. I need to go and make another coffee. One, to stay awake, and two, because my throat is starting to hurt and I need something hot. Though, also, I'm not sure if coffee works as well as tea in that regard, but... You never know.
back. Okay. I am back in black. Today was really fun. What kind of day will tomorrow be? I quietly closed my eyes with that thought in my mind. Third day. It's morning. A new email has arrived from Hinata. Waiting at the park. Let's all go somewhere together. Looks like it came about 30 minutes ago. I should probably hurry up and get to the park. Usa! Hey! Care to save? Absolutely, I care to save. Wait, no, the park is over here. There they are. Good morning, Yataro. Morning. You're late again. So, what are you gonna treat us to today? I am some slack, Honoka. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pay for everything today. Jeez, you're such a goody two-shoes, Hinata. Alright, never mind all that. I don't want you to treat me. Sorry. Don't worry about it. Nothing to apologize for. Okay. Anyway, Hinata said she, uh, she wants to go to an arcade. If there's one around here, I'm sure it's gotta be in the station. Again? What kind of fucking station is that? I thought it was just a train station. I didn't think it was also a diner and an arcade. I get. Oh, actually, no, never mind. Some some train stations do have di. Well. Yeah. Yeah, they do. They do. I, I'm. Do they? I feel like. Do you- no. I feel like they don't exactly have diners, they have more like... Small like, convenience stores where you can just buy snacks. And that's- at least here in England, I don't know. I don't know about Japan, but... Here in England, I think I've seen like maybe one or two stations that have like... Somewhere you can buy... Uh... Snacks. If it was an airport, then yeah, there's definitely diners there. But... I don't know. To be fair, Japan has everything, so let's be honest with you. I, I can believe a train station with a diner. Of course, you are coming along, right? I'm going? I'm not going. Excuse me? It's not a question of, of whether you want to. I'm going to drag you along anyway. Off we go. You're not the help. This is the station, right? That's a hotel. Which is... It should be fair, the hotel has literal tables to sit at. Where you can probably order food. But no. Nah. 
Oh, this is where the this is where the choices matter. Don't skip. We're here. This place is pretty big. Yeah. But it's not that big compared to the one in Tokyo. Really? Wow, Tokyo's awesome. I've never even been there. I've never even been there once. What is that? A hospital? It's a it's an arcade. Or at least, like, it's supposed to be, like, a station, but... Like, apparently it also has a diner and an arcade in it. So, what did you want to do here again? Oh, um... Uh... I don't have a camera, so... This. A photo booth? Wow, that takes me back. Look how high-tech they are now. Yeah, you can even draw the- You can even draw on them with a pen. Yeah, most arcades have diner. They do? Uh, do train stations have arcades and diners? Even draw on them with a pen. Let's do it together. It's been so long since uh, we've been able to get together like this. Okay, okay. It's kind of embarrassing, but let's take some photos as a keepsake. Alright, here you go, Honoka. This one's yours. Oh yeah, I forgot to tear them off. Thanks. And here's one for you, Yataro. Thanks, I don't wanna. Uh, thanks. No problem. <laughs> now... We all have one. This is my first picture that has all three of us together. That makes this pretty valuable. Thanks, Hinata. <laughs> You're welcome. Mm hmm. Ah. It's so cute. <laughs> uh... Usa. It's the man, the myth, the legend, Usa. There's a crane game with a stuffed bunny inside. Yes, get the Usa plushie. I want it, but it looks kind of hard to get. Yeah, it does. Let me try. Ah. Nope, I can't. The arm's too weak to pull it up. Let Let me try it. I don't think we'll be able to get it. It looks like it's gonna be really hard to wriggle it out of there. Yataro, you try it too. Leave it to me. Okay, but you're paying. Doesn't look like I have a choice, do I? Alright, alright. 
Good luck, Yataro. This time I tried my hand at it. Protagonist power. Protagonist power. A amazing, how'd you do it? Wow, you're a real piece of work. I'm impressed. We got the bunny. Great. What now? Give it to Honoka, give it to Hinata, keep it for yourself. Give it to Hinata, she's the one who... Who wanted it. This is where the- this is where the choices matter, isn't it? Oh. Uh. Well, that was not what I expected. Huh? Really? I'm so happy, Yataro. I mean, she's the one who wanted it in the first place, like... <laughs> Thank you, I'll treasure it forever. Usa! Care to save? Yes. Sot sex. There are emails from Honoka and Hinata. Honoka, waiting at the pier. Hinata, our usual spot, okay? Something bad is gonna happen. What if I go to the pier instead? Mm. Is it just me or is the music kind of creepy? Oh, Yataro! I'm glad you came. Like, it's not creepy, but it has this, like, this RPG Maker horror vibe, my, like, like it's a map from, like, from like the witch's house or something, you know? It kind of has that vibe. I'm glad you came. I thought you might have been asleep already since it's so late. <laughs> it's been fun, Yataro. Don't you think it's great that we can have fun like this every day? Yeah, it is fun. Right? But... Life is made up of good days and bad days. Even if you try to live in a way where you don't hurt anyone or get hurt by anyone. It's still rare to have long periods of time where every day is happy. No matter how tolerant we try to be, it's hard to be friends with everyone out there. Yes, after all, there are people who don't want to be friends with me. I wonder if I'll have to go back. Back to Tokyo. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to go back. I want to stay here with you forever. Hinata hugged me tightly. Put my arm around her and rubbed her back. 
Hey, Yataro? Stay like this. Don't let go of me. Please. Yataro? I love you. I don't want to be apart from you. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that going too far? No, not at all. This is like so not happening. No, not at all. Really? I'm glad. Not that I'm going to go now. Good night. Do I do the right thing? Picking one out of the two of them would be... Like rubbing dirt in the other's face. But I picked one. Even though there are no do-overs in life, I went and picked one. Now, no matter how it turns out in the end, I'm sure... I'm sure the three of us won't be able to stay together anymore. Our precious days, people, daily lives. What kind of day will tomorrow be? I quietly close my eyes with that thought in mind. Hinata loved Yataro. I also loved Yataro. Well, it's your fault for not saying so, you moron. Then Hinata went away. Even though I didn't ask for it, it was a chance I couldn't waste, but... Yataro stopped hanging out with me. He spoke to me less and less. And then we stopped meeting altogether. We had become distant, dis din, di distanced from each other. Both Yataro and Hinata were far away from me now. Our happy days were slowly riding away. I am lonely. I want to talk to him again. I want to see him again. Well then start paying for fucking... Alright, how about you start paying when we go out, yeah? How about that? Instead of making me pay for everything. So I went to Yatoro's house to hang out. Yatoro's mom was happy to have me around, but... Yatoro only looked at me with a sullen face, as if he were bothered by me. I knew it. I noticed it, but... I pretended not to notice. I just wanted to be with him. Hmm. I wonder why Hinata came back. Is it because she doesn't want me to steal Yataro? That seems like something she could say. What perfect timing, too. If it wasn't for her, he would have given it to me. Curse you, curse you, curse you. Damn you to hell, damn you to hell, damn you to hell. Um, I... The truth is... I love Yataro too. Ah, so that's how it is.
and uh huh you're too late I mean he pretty much belongs to me now damn what a bitch hold up you saw it with your own two eyes didn't you Yataro chose me. Well, now one of them is gonna die. He gave the stuff toy to me. Ah. Please give up, Honoka. Yataro has already chosen me. Fourth day. The day where everything goes wrong. Oh! The fourth day, because in Japanese, four, you say it either as yon or as shi, which means death. So, yeah, it's the day where death happens. Um, Yataro? Is this really okay? It's fine. I want to be alone with you. It's fine. What is happening here? Hmm, that sounds kind of suspicious. I'm coming in now. Huh? There really isn't anyone else around. I guess your mom's gone out somewhere. Which means we're all alone right now. I called Hinata over to my house. I didn't say anything to Honoka. My parents are out, so the two of us are, all, are alone. The mood felt right, so I lightly pushed Hinata onto the bed. Ah. Uh, I feel like a chainsaw is about to come. Yataro. Jeez, you're pretty brave trying that. Um, but I... I'm okay with whatever you do to me. So, go ahead and do what you want. Oh god. YouTube. Yeah. Yantara, you horn dog. But I kind of feel, I don't know, happy. You two behave. Barely looks like anything. Come on now. So, you can get even braver if you want. Where's the option to not do that? Fuck it. Great. Okay, that's not too bad. Ah. Yataro, you perv. Eh, <laughs> this is kind of embarrassing. Let's not turn this into a hentai. Come on, no stare so much. Yataro. Doing this view is like a dream come true. Yeah. Better be gentle, okay? This is actually the first time I've done this kind of thing, you know? Promise you'll be gentle. No, 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 no. I, I do, no. I. Uh, hold on, where's the window capture? This one I'm not showing. You got me fucked up. Okay, never mind. <laughs> it faked it out. The fake out. The absolute fake out. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, Honoka? What is this? This isn't funny. 
So you're saying I'm not needed? I literally never said that in my life. Today, we were all supposed to hang out together. Today. Um. <laughs> Honoka. What is that? What is that you're holding? Oh. Oh. Um. No, see. It's kind of. It's like that. Um. I, well. I love Yataro. So, you're kind of an obstacle. <laughs> Come on, Yataro, get up, sleepy head. Ah. Jeez, you're finally up. Good morning. You were making a racket there. We're having a scary dream. I don't think it was a dream. Well, I'm sure you, you were just having some kind of dirty dream. I know you. Why are you in my room? Huh? Wait, wait, wait. Don't tell me you forgot already. I emailed you about it the other day. We were gonna do something fun today. You even promised. I did? Ugh. Are you telling me you forgot that too? I'm shocked. You really are horrible. You forgot our promise to me. Your promise to me. It's morning, huh? That's right. All that stuff up until now was just a dream. It was all just one long, long nightmare. And now I've woken up, just like any other day. Hinata never came back from Tokyo. It's just me and Honoka here, as usual. I know the truth. Hoping and waiting for Hinata to return is meaningless. I'm dating Honoka. In fact, it was probably fate that led me to be with Honoka. So... Yeah, this is reality. Did you have memory loss or something? Did she hit your head with a baseball bat? Like... Like, I get thinking that... Like, it was a nightmare, sure, I get that, but like... Remembering that you're dating her when that never happened, like, you're... Kind of, uh... It's not exactly how... Dreams work, or like, non-dreams work, or like... I don't know, yeah, this is reality. Yataro. Yeah, I'll be more honest with my feelings from now on. So, pay attention to me, okay? Not that I'm doing it for you or anything, Baka. This is strictly for my own sake, got it? It's so I don't have any regrets. Love you. Yataro. When a cup brought her face close to mine. The moment, our, the moment our lips met, caught a glimpse of it. Behind Honoka was.
What the fuck is that? <laughs> so, that box caught your attention. What do you think is inside? Do you want to know? Go on, open. There's something I hate inside. I had fully woken up now. Reality had thrust itself into my mind, shattering the delusion my denial had built up. I immediately tried to get up. Uh huh? I couldn't move my body. I looked down to see my body wrapped with rope. And you didn't notice until now? <laughs> Whose fault do you think this is? Come on. Tell me. Whose fault is it? Yours? It's yours. It's all your fault. No, I'm pretty sure this is you. This is all you. Like, I didn't do anything. It's your fault for choosing Hinata. Yeah, well, it's your fault for shedding bloodshed, bitch. If only you had chosen me back then, none of this would have happened. Don't like it? Well... Why don't you just start over? I'm sure you know a way to avoid this kind of future. This music. Was it... This music was in... This music was in Angels of Death, right? And I think Pokemon used this too. I can never escape this music. Oh my god, hold up. I'm sure you know a way to avoid this kind of future. Yeah, I do. I just need to change some some options. <laughs> but hey, don't you think that's just sad? Doesn't it all make you feel lonely? No, I always prefer the Inata anyway. Or do you not care? Because this is all just fiction anyway. Okay, uh, you're starting to get a little bit too close to the fourth wall. You, yeah, it's starting to crack a little bit. You might want to back away. You think it's fine just to start over if you don't like the ending, right? A again, uh, again, fourth wall. It it it's it's starting to crumble. Just uh. Get away from the screen a little bit. That's why... I'll burn myself into your memory. Right into the back of your mind. I'll make you remember my existence. So... Don't forget about me. The fact that I existed. <laughs> The fact that I was together with you like this. Don't forget them. Even if you go down a different route. I'll always love you so, so much. Don't worry, I'm probably about to see you getting murdered. So like, yeah. I love you. Uh-huh. Onoka began removing my, phew, removing my pants and underwear. Uh, it's about to go... Hen is this about to become a hentai or is she about to chop my dick off? It was all out on full display. I tried with all my might to move my body in a desperate attempt to escape. But the rope was simply wound too tightly around me. 
Honoka, open the scissors in her hand wide. Oh no. She brought them next to my crotch. Oof. Oh, oh sevens. Oh sevens for the poor dude. Well, what's my sad face? This one. Oh, oh sevens. Really? This one. This one hurts. This one hurts to think about. Yikes. And then. Oh sevens. Oh sevens for the poor guy. True and one trembling. This is a true end? Oh my god. Like, I thought that the true endings where like the main protagonist dies in like the other games was bad. This one is way worse. This one you get your dick chopped off. Oh. Oh you poor soul. Ah. So, uh... Yeah, that happened. Poor guy. Poor Yataro. He didn't deserve to get his dick chopped off. Like, sure, maybe, like, if he lost his life, that would be one thing, but, like, he lost his dick. That's way worse. Alright, let's load. Let's, uh, let's see real quick. Yep, alright. There's, email, there's emails from Honoka and Inata. Alright. Let's see Honoka's, um... Honoka's... Lines. And here we can actually see a scenery that we haven't seen at all in the game. Yataro! You made it! So, you left those flowers there, huh? That was pretty surprising. But, it's good that you did. I... I guess I kind of underestimated you. Sorry about that. Well, you're embarrassing. Um, well... <laughs> Don't take this the wrong way, though. It's not like I'm falling in love with you or anything, Baka. Don't get cocky. I'm only... reassessing my opinion of you. So don't... Read into it too much. Just... What got into you? Ever since Hinata moved, you stopped talking to me. You didn't come over to play anymore either. And you went and dyed your hair that color. 
Then you started rebelling against our teachers and your mom. I was lonely. It was a dark time for me. Huh? Well... I guess the one thing that hasn't changed is how much you treasure your memories. And that's one of the good things about you. But... Hinata can't stay here forever. She just... Came to hang out for a while. Are you going to hole up in your room again? Once Hinata leaves? I mean... Why not use this as a chance to change yourself for the better? It's not like I'm gonna force you though. I just want you to be a little more cheery. It's gotten pretty late. I think I'm gonna go home and get to bed. So, Yataro. See you tomorrow. Alright, and now, uh, gonna close, restart the game, and load from file, so that was file 2, 3, file 4, yeah, file 4 should be good. Hold on, Kanyata, I'm gonna wait for you here, I'll whack you if you don't come, secret base, I'll be waiting for you, okay. Let's go to the pier. Oh, so you came. Yataro. Say something funny. Don't just sit there quietly. Say... Something. Ah. Okay, look. Here. Take them. What do you mean, what are they? They're cookies. Ah, you mean you don't remember? I used to make them for you all the time. How could you not remember, jerk? I went through the trouble of making them. So don't let any... So don't let any go to waste. Did you do this for me? Do you like me? Uh, no, it's not like they're for you or anything, Baka. They're for your mom. Yeah, she's always helping me out and stuff. So be sure to give them to her later, alright? Ah, jeez. Don't get the wrong idea, okay? These are just a token of my appreciation. Well, I'll be going then. See you tomorrow. I think this is where the arcade is, right? It's not. Today was really fun. Gonna deal with tomorrow, be. Alright. Third day. Yep. Okay, this is where the arcade is. This is where the choices matter.
Why is there no way to speed up this dialogue? I got the engine this was made of is really old, but like, god damn it. I'm going. Of course you are, now let's go. To the decisions. What now? Give it to Honoka. Kind of stuff doesn't really suit me. Give it to Hinata. What? What's with that look? Well, this kind of thing doesn't happen every day, so I guess I'll accept it. Not that I'm happy or anything, not one bit. Baka. Here, visual spot, okay. Let's go up the pier, see what, uh, what, uh, what she has to say. Oh. Yataro. You came. Seem out of it. Uh huh. What do you mean? There's nothing wrong with me. Are you saying there is? You dumbass. There's nothing bothering me. I I'm not worrying about anything at all. Yeah, I've been thinking about telling you this for a while. You want to know, don't you? Why I used to go over to your house to play every day. The truth is... It wasn't really because I wanted to talk to your mom. I just wanted to be with you again. I wanted to talk to you again. Surprised? No. Not in the slightest. Don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> of course, it's been so long after all. I love you. I really, really do. So much it hurts. Ever since we were little, you've been the only boy I cared about. It's okay. You don't have to give me your reply right now. I'll wait. I'll wait for you. Well, good night. It's night. Did I do the right thing? Picking one out of two would be like rubbing dirt in the other's face. But I picked one. Even though there are no do-overs in life, I went and picked one. Now, no matter how it turns out in the end, I'm sure. I'm sure the three of us won't be able to stay together anymore. Our precious days, people, daily lives. What kind of day will tomorrow be? 
Probably close my eyes with that thought in my mind. Cinderella. Even though she was more beautiful, more kind, more precious, more cheerful than anyone else. It never did her any good. Her sisters worked her to the bone every day. She was unable to go to the ball, unable to meet her prince. All she could do was clean. The princess covered in cinders. Wait. Cinderella has a happy end, right? I am the princess. I've been reading too many fairy tales, girl. It's supposed to have a happy end, right? This isn't fair. I've been taken to this dirty city, far away from my prince. All because of my parents. I have to be a straight A student. I have to be a good girl. Why? Because I don't want people to get mad at me. Because I don't want to be bullied. I have to study hard every day. I live every day in fear. I... I'm going to break away from all of this. And go to see my prince. I don't want to wait anymore. Am I a bad person? Even though I know how Hinata feels, I still... I wonder why Yataro gave me the stuffed toy. Is it because he was too embarrassed too embarrassed to give it to Hinata? But in the end he gave it to me. He looked at me for once. No. This is bad. I can't get together with the person I like if it means betraying my best friend. I just can't do that. I mean, Hinata's my best friend. She's precious to me. That's not what you said in the other ending. I'm sure there are times when I felt like I kind of hated her a little. We are rivals in a way, but... Ah, uh, what should I do? You idiot. How about you just be honest with yourself? Oh god, now she has a dual personality. Who was that? It's me. Oh god, she does have a double personality. Kinda of looks like Roman. My reflection in the water is speaking to me. Who are you? It's me, of course. But forget about me, are you a dumbass? Friends are worthless anyway. So just shut up and take Yataro already. Shut up, leave me alone. You really are stupid. Don't you get it? Yata was hoping for you to lose, you know? She pretended to be your friend while warning you to back off. Remember how she wanted you to cheer her on? Don't tell me you didn't even notice that. Shut up. Come on, quit trying so hard. Give yourself a break already. You knew how much Hinata loved Yataro. And yet, Yataro still chose you. Ah. He chose me. That's right. You should be happy about it. The feelings you've 
been harboring for a painfully long time have finally reached him. That's right. I'm sure. I want Yataro a lot more than Hinata does. So... Fourth day. Hey, are you sure you're okay with this? Yeah, my parents are out today. I see. Still, the two of us being alone. Not that I have a problem with it, but... I called Honoka over to my house. Didn't say anything to Hinata. My parents are out, so the two of us are alone. The mood felt right, so I lightly pushed Honoka into, onto the bed. Uh... Hey, stupid, what do you think you're... <sighs> Put yourself together. Do you have a death wish? You know you like it? Are you being coy? Uh, you know you like it. N no way. That's totally not it, I just... I'm just a little embarrassed, that's all. Uh... Take off her camisole. Ugh. What? Well, excuse me for having them in white. You're messing with me, aren't you? You perv. Ah, jeez. What's with that stare? If you're gonna do it, hurry up already. Cut her skirt. Hmm? This is embarrassing. Yeah, especially for me that I have to stream this shit. This is actually... This is actually my first time doing this kind of thing. What should I do? You don't have to do anything. Yata. Be gentle, okay? Gonna beat the hell out of you if you aren't. YouTube, remember this is this is a drawing. Uh this should be a fake out, right? Yes, it is, okay. Oh wow. You didn't even like show up. You just did it and then you appeared. No. Taro. Come on. Yataro. Get up, Yataro. Ah. Jeez, you're finally up. Good morning. You're making a lot of noise in your sleep. Were you having a bad dream? Or were you having a dirty dream? After all, look at that. You horn dog, you. Why are you in my room? Jeez, are you trying to play dumb? You promised we'd go on a date today. You're so slow to show up that I came to get you. It's morning, huh? That's right. All that stuff up until now was just a dream. 
It was all just one long, long nightmare. Hinata never transferred schools. She was still here, and we were all having fun spending our summer days together. I told Hinata about my feelings for her. We were going out, so how exactly are you remembering things wrong? Like, how... How exactly... Like, unless that's a dream you had, but... Like, that's the only explanation. Like, unless he had a dream that he confuses for reality, and... Like, the re real reality is, like, what he thinks right now is the dream, so, like, I guess, maybe, but, like, that's never explained. We were going out. In fact, it was probably fate that led me to be with Hinata. So? Yeah, this is reality. Hey, Yataro? How about a good morning kiss? Hmm? Where's Honoka? Something's not right. Something's not right. Huh? Did you say something? Hmm? Yataro, do you like Honoka? Oh please, that must be some sort of delusion. You're my prince. There's no way you could like Honoka. After all, you made that problem we made that promise when we were kids. That's why now... Now, no one will get in our way anymore. <laughs> so, Yataro... Could you keep your eyes on me, and only me? That is like the biggest red flag, when someone says that. Hinata brought her face close to mine. The moment our lips met, I caught a glimpse of it. Behind Hinata was... Oh. <laughs> Mahonoka's dead. <laughs> Why? Also, Honoka put Hinata in a box. Hinata just left her there. Just hanging around. Mahonoka's dead. Yataro. Are you gonna run away? I had fully woken up now. Reality had thrust itself into my mind. Shattering the delusion my denial had built up. I ran out of there as fast as I could. I had to get away as quickly as possible, so she didn't even tie me up. <laughs> so you are going to run. Hinata was coming after me with some sort of sword. She catches me, I'm done. I'm sure of, I'm done for, I'm sure of it. Is this reality? Something really bad is happening. All I can do right now is keep running. I'm finished the moment my legs stop moving. I kept running. That's right. It came to me as soon as I... It came to me so suddenly, I was briefly confused. All this time I was actually together with Honoka. Hey Yataro, let's see what, which one of us can run faster. <laughs> Chasing after you is so fun. Hey, can you hear me? Running out of the house. Running down the streets. Running through the forest into the into a valley. 
for some reason. I felt like I was being lured towards less and less populated areas. Even though I was running as fast as I could and panting fran frantically, completely out of breath. Hinata's breathing was completely normal. I wonder why that was, but I didn't have time to... Ah. Uh, I pathetically tripped over myself and went tumbling. <laughs> Yataro, I caught you. And now, I'm not gonna let you get away. I wanted to run away. But my legs... My legs could have moved another inch. My leg! Cowering and trembling, I couldn't even stand up. <laughs> Welcome to the ball, Yataro. Huh? You're still trying to run? I think you should probably give up now. It'll be bad for both of us if you keep trying. Don't worry. I'll make sure to get you back home before the clock strikes 12. So... So, for this special occasion, I'll make sh I'll, I'll make it so you can't run away anymore. First, your right foot. Wow, just as expected from a sword this sharp. <laughs> now it's time for your left foot. Oh, this? This is my favorite sword. I call it Masamune-chan. I hope you two get along well. It was lying around the house, so I thought I'd take it for self-protection. I thought it might be a fake sword, but I guess it was real after all. Wow. I think my family might be pretty incredible. Isn't this a katana? Doesn't look like one. I always heard that katanas are super sharp. And I guess it was true. Oh, that's it. I just thought of something good. Hey, Yataro. Did you know a person can live without their arms and legs? Well, yeah, they can. Because they're not attached to any vital parts, but... I mean... They can't really do much to, for themselves anymore by that point. Let's, let's try it out. Don't worry, there's nothing to be scared of. Once you've lost your arms and legs, Hinata will do everything for you. Okay, then here I go. What? I can't cut it very well. Because there's something... Because something hard's in the way. Oh, of course. It's bone. That's all it is. Just bone. How funny. <laughs> what? This gentle looking angel of a girl is doing something like this? Yeah, she looks like an angel, totally. An angel from hell, but still an angel. I wonder. I wonder why it all turned out this way. <laughs> In the end, it doesn't even matter. In the end, Yataro. Once this is all over, you're just gonna throw me in the trash. No, I'm gonna erase this and go get a different ending. Oh, I know. I can see right through you. Of course I know, I've been watching you this whole time. 
It's true, this is pretty irrational, isn't it? But you're the one who made the choice. And really, you should have just chosen me, Yataro. Well, I did the first time. I don't, know, I don't think you remember, but I did, technically. So, te actually, you know what? It's your fault for not remembering, so... Come on. You should have given the, st the stuff toy to me. I did. You gave it to Honoka instead. Well, that was the second one. That means you're at fault. No, you're at fault, alright? You're the one who doesn't remember the previous time, alright? I get you died at the end, but like, still. Yes, I think it's your fault. Well, I think it's your fault. Oh, yeah. Let's just start over from the beginning. You know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah, starting a new game. This one is just an illusion anyway. It's fiction. You can restart as many times as you want. Okay, you're getting a little too close to the fourth wall. Right? So, before the spell wears off, my prince, in the end, Cinderella gets her happy ending. She stays together with her prince forever. <laughs> now die and do it over. Damn. Sure, I'll do it over. True and two. Cinderella's dark. Sniff. So this is goodbye, Yataro. You're also sad that I'll be gone. Thank you. Huh? G getting married? No, we're still in elementary school. I think it's a little too early for that. <laughs> I'm happy to hear that though. Yataro, I love you. It's a promise, got it? Don't forget. So, I'll see you. I'll see you again someday. Take care. It was a nostalgic dream. Why? Why am I remembering something like that just now? As your life is flashing before your eyes? Your eyes? I'm sorry, Hinata. I'm sorry. Okay.
Okay. Load. Um, which one was it? Was it sort five? I hope so. Yeah, yeah, I think it was this. to myself. I'm curious to see what the hell happens here. Keep it for yourself. Happy ending for everyone. I keep the thing. Huh? Eh? Wow, Yataro. I didn't know you liked cute things that much. Hey. It's a Usa plushie, alright? Anything for Usa. What? A surprise. You better treasure that bunny, Yataro. Well, it's fine with me. This is the way to go. So there won't be any competition or hatred. We can all be together forever. I won't give it to either of them. Keep it for myself. No matter the consequences. Even if I have to stay single for the rest of my life. We... We will always stay together, the three of us. We'll share fun times and happy times. We'll share rough times and sad times. We will be the best of friends. I only have one wish. Just... That my precious days... People... And daily life won't... Ever have to fall apart. Bad end. Boring story. Wow. That's the bad ending. <laughs> Ending, you don't die. Wow, what a shitty ending. 